an uptick in school bus crashes. You may remember this one from last Thursday. It sent two students to the hospital. And take a look at this one from earlier this month. A light pole fell on a bus after a crash. And you'll remember this crash back in May that sent dozens of students to the hospital. Experts say seatbelts could have prevented a lot of injuries on school buses. A majority of school buses in Clark County and across the nation, the students aren't wearing seatbelts, but a new product could change that. A rollover or side impact like this one can send children flying. Because of the danger, there's now a push for students to buckle up in buses. A new seat, which hits the market early next year, hopes to reduce injuries and even deaths from school bus crashes. There's been a lot of testing put into these seats. The seat has a sturdy frame and three-point seat belts, which the manufacturer says can help prevent students from being tossed around. So high injury, fatality type situation when you get a body slammed against a hard surface like that. And here in Nevada, school bus drivers are required to wear seat belts, but students are not which is the case across most of the country.